people in the world live in these areas. And that's kind of what I want to get into today with you regarding that. And I've seen this before in the past, and I talk about it with some of my members, and I see it all the time when I travel, is a lot of young guys especially, they feel like they're out of their league when they go to certain areas, or they're intimidated, uh, especially around certain types of women. They get scared. They think either the woman's too wealthy for them, uh, too, uh, too cultured, um, too educated, all these type of things. Listen, don't sell yourself short for one, all right? People are people, I promise you. And as far as finances go, yeah, sure. There's no question. You may or may not have as much money as somebody else, but no one is walking around looking what each is in each other's wallets. No one is walking around knowing uh, what bank, you know, what bank account, what people have in their own bank accounts, how much money they're worth. I'm going to tell you one thing. I know a lot of wealthy people. I've known throughout my life. I know a lot of poor people. Uh, a lot of poor people have actually became very wealthy, and a lot of uh, wealthy people I know have hit hard times, right? And that includes a lot of my family members. I was kind of born between kind of two parallels. My father's side of the family had a lot of wealth, truthfully. Uh, they had, uh, you know, uh, not only living in Illinois, they had summer homes and they had uh, condos in South Florida, some in, on the West Coast. And then my mother's side of the family wasn't that wealthy at all. But as time went on, which is amazing, my mother's side of the family became extremely wealthy, a lot of my family members. Case being, look at yourself, value yourself, uh, value yourself at all times, regardless what position you are. I don't even, I'm not even talking finances here, okay, or lying or bullshitting. I just want you to start becoming comfortable in your own skin and realize that people are people. Treat them with respect, they'll treat you with respect. Don't think because you make a certain amount of money you can only attract a certain type of girl, okay? And don't be like, a, uh, you know, women that have wealth are high maintenances or high maintenance or pieces of shit or all they care about is, you know, uh, material type things. That's not true. We're always kind of throwing women into a certain category, same with men. And it's not fair because not everybody is that way. And even if they are, they are what they are, all right? Don't worry about that. Just start learning to branch out, go to places you may have never gone before. Uh, obviously, you want to be in places where there's a lot of women. I don't care if they're, I don't even care their financial situation, okay? Just start learning to get around women. I keep discussing that. Because uh, the more you do it, the more comfortable you're going to be around those type of people, right? I don't care, well, anything. So I'm going to leave it at that. I also have the podcast going. It's kind of more of a comedic type thing. It's called The Rich Salenza Show. WTF are you talking about? All right? Uh, I wish you guys nothing but the best. Take care.